Hey! How you guys doing? I know, it's been a while, hasn't it? Well, it turns out that Jordan Cross is staying at this hotel. And if you guys remember last time, I tried to join the militia. That was a lot more work than I really kind of wanted to do, and it was kind of boring. It sounds a lot cooler than it actually is. But anyway, one of the items on my bucket list is to join a band. I'm going to have to go get a different outfit because I don't really feel like my current outfit screams punk rock. I'll be back. If I'm going to join a rock band, then I need to find a change of clothes because I feel like he's just going to make fun of me if I look like this. So here's the plan. Step one, find punk rock outfit. Step two, meet the drummer. Hello, sir. Step three, try to gain access to the room he's going in. I need access in here. Can I come Sorry in? For the inconvenience, sir, God but damn it. Step four, ask the drummer politely if I could have his outfit. Excuse me, can I have your outfit? It's great how he's had a whole Excuse me, sir. God damn it. Step five, drummer doesn't want to give said outfit, and he meets his ultimate demise by dare challenging anything that I have to say. All right. Uh, then we're just gonna have to go ahead and take it. I asked nicely and you said no. Bam! I mean, it's not really punk rock. It's kind of more hipster. But it's okay. The guy that I got this from, I mean, the store that I bought this from, it looked definitely a lot cooler on the mannequin than it did on me, so... I mean, but unfortunately I already bought it. I'm kind of stuck with it. Anyway, if you guys were wondering too, I bought it from Baby Gap. I mean, they have a really a nice selection of clothes. Really something that will spark anyone's interest. I don't know why I feel like I'm doing a commercial for Baby Gap all of a sudden. I'm gonna go inside and uh, maybe get something to eat, maybe grab some stuff to drink, and then hopefully go to my auditions and gotta, damn it, I hope it goes well. Is there anyone in this kitchen that can help me? I want a burger and fries and that's not what you have. Oh, hi. Hey, excuse me, sir. You have burger and fries back in the kitchen? Can you make it special order? I assume you're gonna go do it. God damn it. So, what you guys don't know is I'm really hungry. They didn't have a burger and fries for me. They really kind of had nothing. It's kind of disappointing. But, you know, it's really important too that when your stress level's high, you try to relax as much as you can before you go in for your job interview or go in for a band tryout or a lady crosses in front of the camera and you really want to stab her but you're really trying to hold off because that's not who you, that's not the life you lead anymore. I mean, really, you gotta relax and enjoy the small things in life. Like this dirty river that people probably peed in. I mean, it looks nice from here, but I'm not sticking my face in it. That's gross. Listen, do you care that I'm in a band at all? Because you could totally be my lady. I'm in a band, I'm a drummer. Or a guitar player, or singer. We really haven't established what role I am yet. But, uh, I do have tryouts later. Are you gonna be interested in hooking up if that happens? I feel like you're ignoring me on purpose. All right, I'll just go away. Hey, are you guys in interested at all in getting with somebody who's in a band? Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what what role I'm gonna play yet. I'm really kind of trying out for everything, but hopefully I'll get something. And then you guys want to hook up? You, you guys don't want to talk to me at all? God damn it! Hey, you guys want to hook up with the guys that's in a band? No? Yes? Any takers? For the love of God, will someone please touch it? Uh, Alright, I gotta go. You guys are kind of depressing me. Bye. Excuse me, sir. Would you be interested in hooking up with somebody who's in a band? God damn it. Why? Why will no one touch it? This is irritating. What the hell's joining a band for if no one wants to touch a ding-dang? Wait a minute. How the hell did they get that footage? There was nobody filming me while I was doing that. <gasps> That's bullshit. Oh, great. Now there's footage of me joining a militia. I hope they don't realize it was me. This is going to really throw a big old wrench in this whole joining a band thing if they think I was trying to be a militia guy. Oh, God. I hope social media doesn't get a hold of this. I have to go. Jesus Christ. Just shook you. Hey, anybody interested in hooking up with a guy that's in a band? Don't everyone line up at once. No? No takers? God damn it. Hello? Hello, patrons. It is I, here to try out for this band. Wow, you guys are really welcoming. Very cool. Hey, you interested in hooking up with a guy that's in a band? No? 
God damn it. All right, here we go. I think I could do good. Yeah. Oh my god. I actually did really good. I hope I get the job. <laughs> yeah, man. Is that yeah, good? That was cool. Was it good? Uh, you're like some kind of machine, aren't you? Yeah, but oh, listen, man. I really want to try out for done. singing. Can I also do the singing? I'm a bitch. I'm a lover. I'm a child. It's confusing. It's something with my taint. And I feel ashamed. It's help. It's my dream. I'm gonna. Eat the cream, you wouldn't love me any other way. Yeah. Hey, tell Jordan Cross he's awesome. You just, well, he walked by you. Why didn't you just tell him that? Why do I gotta tell him that? So, do you think he did? Why couldn't we have done that? Cross, I mean, you think he killed his girlfriend? Wait, what? Man, oh, God, and I'm gonna go walk with you on a ledge? You're not gonna kill me, are you? Listen, if you take me all the way out here to kill me, I'm gonna be pissed. Yeah, that's the plan. Listen, I really want to be the singer of this band, and I feel like it's not going to happen if you're here. Someone who does the job without getting noticed. Fuck it! I want to be the singer! <laughs> now I will be the singer. Excuse me, I heard you're the producer. Listen, I have an awesome thing that I want to talk to you about. I got a band together. Here, look. I have a band together. Are you interested? Oh, God damn it. Oh, Mr. Think Silex, boss. how are you? Wait, what? Interesting. Tell Jordan I love him. Uh, Jordan's dead, ma'am. Freak accident. He fell off the roof. Head, head first. Literally probably about 15 feet from where you're standing right now. So I don't think I'll be telling him anything. Listen, you don't need to follow me. I can do it on my own. Listen, he passed out, he's had a lot to drink, but I don't need your help. I can carry him on my own, okay? Look. He's fine. He just needs to sleep it off. You don't need to follow me. He's fine. Okay, so, turns out that I needed financing from Ken the Brick in order for me to start my world tour. Ken refused. So, Ken tripped and had an accident. I don't know what happened to him. Everybody doesn't really seem interested. But since Ken refused... Did you refuse to give me anything or help me out and help me live my dream? Then you're not needed anymore. Ken has to go bye bye. Wish him luck. Bye, Ken. Bye now. Alright. Let me know if you need anything, Mr. De Silva. I need a band. Anything. I needed a band. They didn't want me to join. Okay, so turns out. That Jordan had an accident and fell off a roof. I couldn't be held responsible because I heard he killed his girlfriend. I thought he was taking me up to the roof to throw me off. So, mistakes were made. Accidents happened. Uh, they don't want me in this band anymore because Jordan's no longer in the band. Apparently, my singing wasn't good enough for them. And I don't really want to be a drummer. And I guess it doesn't matter anyway because Jordan's not here anymore. So, there goes that idea. Then, of course, Ken the Brick. All he had to do was finance my world tour and he refused. So I'm off. I'm out of this place. I was kind of hoping things would look up and look different, but it doesn't. Nothing ever works out for me. I'm done. I'm leaving. See you guys later. God damn it. She needs to come Hello. over here. Hello. Hello. Hi, Jack. It's Mom. Mom? You are? Oh. She's a why? milf. Why, why have you been fighting? Because you're not at there. School. So where are you now? Fight club. You gotta oh, participate. For why are you in the headmaster's office? Because he's fucking him up next. Well, why were you fighting? Because somebody you talked shit fight. about him. I can't believe you've been fighting. You're not. You are a better boy than this. You are a good boy. I'm I am really, a good boy. I'm really disappointed in you. You sound really awkward talking to your, your son fault. like that. How can it not be your fault if you throw a punch at someone? It was your arm. Yeah, but uh -huh. it wasn't my fist. <laughs> oh. It was your fist. Oh. Okay, well, yeah, I suppose that kind of changes things. I know, right? When it's your you fist, but my arm. To the other confusing. boy. And that's when you hit him. Okay, yeah, I know. I get it now. No, that's when your fist hit him. Yeah. My arm I mean, just I swung. I shouldn't say it, but I'm kind of proud of you now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cool. No, no, don't say that to the headmaster. 
Yeah, don't uh -huh. don't do that. You just punch him in the face. Okay, well look, I mean, just do whatever he says for now. But when you get home tonight, unless it's blowjobs, don't do that. You. Don't do blowjobs. I'm very proud of you. But proud I, of you I too. Uh -huh. Love you. Okay. All right. See you later. Bye. Okay. Bye bye. Step one: <laughs> find punk rock outfit. Step two: go up to drummer guy and ask him to borrow outfit. Step three: realize that drummer boy will not give me outfit. Proceed to have rage moment. Step four. Wait, what shit? What step are we on? Ah, oh, fuck, I forgot already. I'm a bitch, I'm a lover, I'm a child. It's confusing, it's something with my taint. And I feel ashamed. It's help, it's my dream. I'm gonna eat the cream. Wouldn't love me any other way. Damn.